Hey guys, this is yet another HR669 video. This is Bitter Beauty, and I wanted to share my two cents on the topic. Um, and chances are, I'd bet my money that if you're watching this video, and if you're a subscriber of mine, I'm pretty much positive that your one of your pets are on this little shit list of the HR669. And I think, um, I really think that we should, you know, stand up. But honestly, I don't really see it going anywhere, because if you really, really sit around and think about it, the impact on the economy, it'd be like kicking the America while it's down. Like, if you think about it, the economy is already in the crap hole. And if you take away the pet industry, which is like billions and billions of dollars, Americans are crazy about their pets. I'm one of them. I mean, as much money as I spend on my pets, like, they'd be losing a lot of money. And I think it might put America in, like, in the hole, you know? Like, we wouldn't be able to recover. And I don't think, you know, there's bigger things to worry about. There's, there's... Iraq and like the Middle East why are they attacking Americans at their home like at their level like of their pets like really I just don't I don't I'm scared I'm like I'm kind of scared but like at the same time like why did it get so far like then someone think and be like why are we allowing this to happen like isn't there like other things we can worry about than exotic pets and you know I don't know it's just it's it's insane to me like I mean, exotic pets, I mean, I can, if you, sorry I'm rambling, but like, if you think about it, I mean, they should be more specific, like, ferrets and guinea pigs, like, really, that's really, if the, like, I know some people are irresponsible with their pets, like, they don't want them anymore, they set them free into the, into the wild or whatever, but most, like, it's half, like, 50 for 50 chance, like, they don't survive, they're not going to mess up the ecosystem, because they're, they're domestic, they're not, they don't know how to survive in the wild, like, I don't think they would live long enough to mess up the ecosystem. And sure, sure, if you have a... I mean, these people that have freaking crocodiles in their bathtub, sure, go after them. You know, confiscate their crap. But, like, and baby tigers, people who have baby tigers, yeah, I mean, they should be persecuted. But people who have guinea pigs and ferrets and, and reptiles, you know, little reptiles that are legal, I don't, I don't, I don't see the, the, you know, the importance of that and... I mean, we should all get involved, and, you know, I sent my letter to Congress and stuff, but, I mean, I don't, I really just don't see it going through. I mean, you know how much money, you know how much money it would take to enforce this? Like, it would take more money to enforce it. I don't even, they couldn't, they can't even enforce it. Like, think about it, like, they're going to go in every home in America and be like, oh, you have a bearded dragon, we're going to have to take that, you know? I don't, I don't think, like, the whole state lines, going across state lines with it. They're gonna like unless you're sketchy, your car looks sketchy or something. They're not gonna stop you and like search your car. I mean, it'd be so easy. And I mean, how like it's 80% of pets, like pretty much, because like all the pets on the market are like imported. Because America doesn't have any cool pets. Like if you really think about it, that leaves like what cats and dogs. Like you can't even have a bird. It's just insane to me. Like America has no cool pets if you think about it. Even German, well, they're gonna, they gonna get so specific that you can't even have a dog that's not native to America. German Shepherds, they're from Germany. Oh, can't have those, you know? It's so retarded. Like, the only reptile that I can actually think of off the top of my head, other than turtles and stuff, but there's already so many restrictions on turtles. I'm pretty sure they'd be, they'd be one to go to. And the only reptile I can really think of that off the top of my head that actually would be, like, native to America is, like, salamanders. And... <laughs> I'm not, I'm no offense to salamander lovers, but it's just not, they don't do it for me, you know, like, <laughs> like, look at my salamander, I don't, I don't, I don't like salamanders, you know, and I mean, if they were to come to my house and be like, if this bill goes through, which I'm, a, I'm, I'm 90% sure it won't go through, but if they were to come to my house and try to take my animals away, <laughs> I wouldn't be making any more videos, I'd be in jail, <laughs> like, I don't know, like, the positive impact pets have on people, like, I think, honestly, dogs and stuff like they calm people down like if we didn't have pets like I feel like there'd be a lot more like crime because <laughs> I mean if you don't come home and you're and your dogs there you know like lick your face and make you feel better some people don't have people that they can talk to they talk to their pets and I'm not I'm not saying <laughs> don't think I'm crazy or anything but like I think there'd be a lot more shootings and crime and stuff like I don't know do your part get involved send your letters to congress and this is just my two cents about it you know don't don't take it the wrong way, but I don't know. There are much bigger things to worry about than the exotic pet industry and I don't know. 
it would be it would put America I think I don't know just get involved make sure this this bill doesn't get approved or anything and I know it's gonna get it's supposed to go to get deliberated in like a couple days or something but yeah just make sure you do your part and get this bill out of here because I'm I honestly don't see how it got this far like who was like I don't know, I like, if I was a congressperson and someone was like, yeah, let's get, you know, kill the pet industry, I'd be like, really? Really? Are you sure you want to do that? Like, I don't know. I, I guess, I, I guess it's a good thing I'm not in any kind of government or anything, because they'd probably throw me out. <laughs> but yeah, this is another HR 669 video. I know you, you guys are tired of them, but, I mean, it's, it's important. It could, like, change our whole lives. Like, I know it would change my life, because... I love reptiles and like all of, most of my reptiles are not from America. I mean, America's pets suck. Just saying. Thanks for watching. I hope you enjoyed it. Bye.